of this country in despair, hard-working folks struggling to stay afloat, Americans that believe in justice for all. If any of us violated the law, cheated our neighbors of their well-being, or sold out our country for selfish personal benefit, we would suffer the consequences. Our reprehensible president has violated the law, has cheated his constituents of their well-being, and has sold out our country for selfish personal benefit. He must suffer the consequences. He must be impeached. Impeached! 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 The U.S. Constitution states, as part of the Emoluments Clause, that the President must not accept gifts from foreign states. Leaving aside the gift of the election, when provided by Putin and the Russians, the evidence that this illegal President has accepted gifts, sometimes in exchange for policy kickbacks, and has violated the clause consistently and repeatedly is damning and overwhelming. Donald J. Trump refused to give up ownership of his businesses. Donald J. Trump refused to release his tax returns. Donald J. Trump acknowledged that businesses receive funds and profit from foreign governments. Donald J. Trump receives foreign payments for real estate holdings. Donald J. Trump received patents from China and days after shifted suddenly to a pro-China policy. And to quote Stephen Cohen's articles of impeachment, by accepting emoluments from foreign governments without first seeking and obtaining the consent of Congress, Donald J. Trump left himself open to foreign influence and deprived the American people of the assurance that their highest ethical official, elected official, was working on their behalf with undivided loyalty. This president is motivated by self-interest, not by the needs of his constituents. The need for impeachment is painfully obvious. On Tuesday night, the president bragged about the size of his nuclear arsenal and his genitalia and a not so veiled threat to a dangerous leader. Every one of us have, has been put in harm's way because of Trump's recklessness and childishness. That's right. Most of the Congress does nothing. That's right. Maybe they nothing. utter some words in frustration, but most of them do nothing. 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 The members of the Congress that have submitted articles of impeachment are heroes. The ones that haven't are cowards. Congressperson Marsha Fudge describes the president as a clear and present danger to our democracy. She's right. For his emoluments clause breaches, for his racist acts and words, for his history of sexual assault, for his relentless, constant deceit, for his slanderous attacks on the press, obstruction of justice, and for risking the lives of every American. Donald, Donald Trump, Trump should, should be impeached. impeached. Stop, Stop looking, looking the other way. way. Stop pretending it's all okay. Stop making excuses for him. him. Stop propping him up for personal gain. Stop abandoning logic. Stop the charade. We are calling upon every U.S. resident to do everything they can to call for impeachment. Protest. Shout from the rooftops. Pressure every congressperson. Be brave. We will impeach. 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 Impeach.